Okay, the hardest part about learning how to surf fish for me was uh, learning how to tie some of the knots. And the, uh, the toughest knot for me was the uh, blood knot. Especially if you're out there and you're uh, into a big school of Pompano and you get sharked off and uh, now you're uh, relying on your newfound skill sets to get that shock leader tied in so you can get that pole back in the ocean and keep catching Pompano. So uh, I got a quicker way for you. It'll make your life easier. Uh, what you're going to do is, um, in my case, I'm using monofilament on both. Uh, I got a heavy 50 pound shock leader and I've got a 20 pound mono that goes on my spinning reel. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to put those two together and we're going to make a loop. Okay. After you make that loop, you're just going to take the tag ends and pull it through the loop. All right. That's it. So now we're going to cut off the excess. Okay. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take that loop and have that knot pointing down and make it about as big as a tennis ball. And you're going to hold one side with your uh, one middle finger and the other side, and that way it won't get away from you. And uh, we're going to only want four revolutions because I'm using 50 pound test. Now you might be able to go with five, experiment a little bit, see how your knots come out, but I go with four with 50 pound test. And that way it'll cinch up better. And all we're going to do is we're going to lace this, okay, for revolutions. So let's put our finger in the bottom. And there's one, two, three, four. All right, so now all we got to do is sneak that knot up through that hole and grab it with our teeth. Try to keep it even. That's important. All right. We're going to cinch it up just enough so we can lubricate it. We don't want to tie this dry or you're going to have a weak knot. So let's lubricate it. Let's cinch it up. And that's it. You got yourself a blood knot. All you got to do now is take your clippers and uh, trim it up a little bit. Remember, this is a blood knot, so you can get pretty close. And, and that's it. You are done. You are ready to start surf fishing. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe to our Pompano Brownie channel. And that'll do it for this video.